This world is just too small. Somewhere out there, there's this tree with star-shaped fruit. we'll ever be a team again. Looks like all the things that once held us together just push us further away. And now the light has led me here. What am I supposed to do? Say that because nobody lives out here and I know you're not from the main island smart kid so how about you what are you doing here oh 
My friend's dad took us out on the boat. This is where we like to play. But they won't let us row out here by ourselves. Not till we get older. Must be hard, huh? Stuck in one place. I heard once there was a kid who left for good. So how did you get here anyway? Is there some reason you're interested in the outside world? Yeah. I want to be strong one day. Like that kid who left. He went to the outside world. I bet he's really strong now. I know it's out there somewhere. The strength that I need. Strength for what? To protect the things that matter. You know, like my friends. Outside this tiny world is a much bigger one. In your hand, take this key. So long as you have the makings, then through this simple act of taking, its wielder you shall one day be, and you will find me, friend. No ocean will contain you then. No more borders around or below or above, so long as you champion the ones you love. You gotta keep this a secret, okay? Otherwise, all the magic will wear off. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what was that all about? Uh, you know. Know what? Why won't you tell me? Who was that guy? Somebody you know? Maybe. Oh, there you go again. Just tell me. I really can't. I've gotta keep it a secret. Not with me, you don't. I'm like the best secret keeper in the world. Nice try. <laughs> oh, Riku! Protect the things that matter. Right. My friends matter to me, too. So, I still have things that I have to protect. Tara, Fen, I hope we're ready for the storm that's coming. Hey, oh. wait up! Too slow, Sora. See you at the finish line. Time, you just got lucky. Mm -hmm. Huh? 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh. so sincere, just like Tara. And this one, he's a spitting image of Ven. <laughs> hmm? One of you might be special enough. Hey, you two mind telling me your names? I'm Sora! And you? Riku. 
Someone has already passed this boy the power. Was it Tara? Hmm. Sara, do you like Riku? Of course I like him. He's my best friend. Good. So then, if something happens and Riku is about to get lost, or say he starts wandering down a dark path alone, you make sure to stay with him and keep him safe. That's your job, Sora. And I'm counting on you to do it, okay? One keyblade is enough for any friendship. I learned it the hard way. I wouldn't wish our lives on those children. Tara, please tell me, what's to become of us? Somewhere? I'm through with you. Well, I'm just getting started with you. You're strong enough now to fulfill your purpose. So what are you waiting for? Join with me right here and now. Become the Keyblade. No. I won't do it. He told me the only way the Keyblade can be forged is if you and me fight. Well, guess what? I'm not fighting. You used to be too broken to talk back. Give you a reason to fight. What? Come and find me. At the one and only place to spawn the Keyblade. The Keyblade Graveyard. There, you're gonna see me choke the life out of Terra and Aqua. Then we'll see how long you play the pacifist. Wait! I swear I'll put an end to this. Hey, I'm gonna head back. Uh, yeah, me too. Huh? Sora? What's wrong? Huh? You're... Uh, that's weird. It's like... Something squeezing me inside. Somebody up there must be sad. Up where? They say every world is connected by one great big sky. So maybe there's somebody up there in all those worlds who's really hurting. And they're waiting for you to help them. Well, gee, do you think there's something I could do? Hmm. 
Maybe they just need you to open your heart and listen. Mmm, I don't know, Riku. You say some weird stuff sometimes, but I'll try it. Okay. Mmm. Well, you know, I think it worked. <laughs> Give me a break, Kyrie. So are you, lazy bum. I knew that I'd find you snoozing down here. No, this huge black thing swallowed me up. I couldn't breathe, I couldn't... Ow! Are you still dreaming? It wasn't a dream. Or was it? I don't know. What was that place? So bizarre. Yes, yeah, sure. Say, Kyrie, what was your hometown like? You know, where you grew up? I've told you before. I don't remember. Nothing at all? Nothing. Do you ever want to go back? Hmm, well, I'm happy here. Really? But you know, I wouldn't mind going to see it. 
I'd like to see it too. Along with any other worlds out there. I want to see them all. So what are we waiting for? Hey! Aren't you guys forgetting about me? So... I guess I'm the only one working on the raft. Ugh. <laughs> and you're just as lazy as he is. <laughs> so you know this. Okay, we'll finish it together. I'll race you. Huh? What? Are you kidding? <laughs> Ready? Go! <laughs> ah, the breeze feels great. Okay, don't hold back. Oh, better luck next time. Oh, I can't believe I lost. Hey, Sora, have you heard about the legendary power of the Palpu fruit? They say if you share it with someone you really care for, it binds you together forever and ever, through eternity. <sighs> it's so romantic. I gotta try it sometime. Oh. What? That's all you got? You got lucky. Hey, what's happening, man? Show me your stuff. Man, that really hurt. Me and Titus, we are gonna do a little exploring today. You know, to the secret place at the base of that tree. There's gotta be something there, yeah? Oh! Woohoo! Yeah! We've been training a lot, yeah? Hey, Sora! You feel lucky today? You're going down! You really think you can beat me? Oh man, I'm really off today. I think you've gotten stronger, but odds are you're still no match for Riku. We took him on three to one last time, and he whipped us all. Well, I guess Kyrie can always count on him. No contest. Oh man, what's up? Let's get it! Hey, you guys, I think we overdid it. I can't believe we lost. Not your day, I guess. Man, you're unreal. So, Kyrie's home is out there somewhere, right? Could be. We'll never know by staying here. But how far could a raft take us? Who knows? If we have to, we'll think of something else. So, suppose you get to another world. <laughs> what would you do there? Hmm. Well, I, I haven't really thought about it. It's just, I've always wondered why we're here on this island. If there are any other worlds out there. Why did we end up on this one? And suppose there are other worlds. Then ours is just a little piece of something much greater. So, we could have just as easily ended up somewhere else, right? I don't know. Exactly. That's why we need to go out there and find out. Just sitting here won't change a thing. It's the same old stuff. So let's go. You've been thinking a lot lately, haven't you? Thanks to you. If you hadn't come here, I probably would have never thought of any of this. Kari, thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Sora! You wanted one, didn't you? A palpu fruit? If two people share one, their destinies become intertwined. They'll remain a part of each other's lives, no matter what. Come on, I know you want to try it. What are you talking? <laughs>
Who's there? I've come to see the door to this world. Huh? This world has been connected. Well, what are you talking about? Tied to the darkness. Soon to be completely eclipsed. Well, whoever you are, stop freaking me out like this. Huh? Well, where did you come from? You do not yet know what lies beyond the door. So you're from another world? There is so very much to learn. You understand so little. Oh yeah? Well you'll see. I'm gonna get out and learn what's out there. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing can understand nothing. Now, Riku has changed. What do you mean? Well... Hmm... Are you okay? Sora! Let's take the raft and go! Just the two of us! Huh? <laughs> Just kidding! What's gotten into you? You're the one that's changed, Kairi. Maybe. You know, I was a little afraid at first. Now I'm ready. No matter where I go or what I see, I know I can always come back here. Right? Yeah, of course. That's good. Sora, don't ever change. Huh? I just can't wait. Once we set sail, it'll be great. Wait, once we set sail, it'll be great. A storm? Oh no, the raft! Sora, dinner's ready, come on down. Sora? open. What? The door is open, Sora. Now we can go to the outside world. What are you talking about? We've got to find Kyrie. Kyrie's coming with us. Once we step through, we might not be able to come back. We may never see our parents again. There's no turning back. But this may be our only chance. We can't let fear stop us. I'm not afraid of the darkness. Riku?
this world has been connected. What was that? Tied to the darkness. Soon to be completely eclipsed. There is so very much to learn. You understand so little. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing can understand nothing. Take a look at this tiny place. To the heart-seeking freedom, this island is a prison, surrounded by water. And so this boy sought out to escape from his prison. He sought a way to cross over into other worlds, and he opened his heart to darkness. Don't bother. Your voice can no longer reach him where he is. His heart belongs again to darkness. All worlds begin in darkness. And all so end. The heart is no different. Darkness sprouts within it. It grows, consumes it. Such is its nature. In the end, Every heart returns to the darkness whence it came! You see, darkness is the heart's true essence. That's not true! The heart may be weak, and sometimes it may even give in. But I've learned that deep down there's a light that never goes out. Come this far, and still you understand nothing. Every light must fade, every heart return to darkness! This is... where I met those children. So many worlds have been lost. And now they're trapped here in the dark. Wait, you know this place, Aqua? Yes. I visited once. And I met two boys I considered passing the Keyblade on to. But because Terra had already given one of them the power, I didn't. Aqua, what were the boys' names? They were... Sora and Riku. I see. We're getting warm. Huh? Well, it's Sora and Riku who've been helping me. We're trying to get that door shut for good. Uh, the same boys? Aqua, if this is where my friends first got the Keyblade, it also must be where we'll find its counterpart. The Keyblade of Darkness has got to be here on the dark side of their world. Uh. We'll have to hurry. Come on!
Let's keep going. I bet it's in here.
the island! Okay, I have to keep her safe. Namine, can you hear me? Oh. Namine. Sora, you really came for me. It's you. It's really you. I've been through so much just to see you. Yes. I wanted to see you too, but this isn't right. I must stop. I wanted to see you, but this isn't the right way. Namine? I was lonely for so long. I just couldn't bear it anymore. So I called out to your heart and had you come all the way out to this place. You came for me and I'm so, so happy, but... But to your heart I had to. Don't worry. I'm here because I promised that I would protect you. Sora. Thank you. And I'm sorry. I'm not supposed to be in this picture. That's true. Ugh. Nominee? That isn't me. I'm not there. I don't really exist inside your heart. I don't exist in anyone's heart. I never have existed anywhere. What... what are you saying? What's gotten into you? Weren't we inseparable? Always together? But then, you had to go away. I came here so I'd never lose you again. Was it really me you wanted to see? Of course it was! I know I've forgotten a lot of things in this castle. But never anything about you. Look! You gave this to me, didn't you? You have it. My good luck charm. No, Sora. You can't believe me. What am I supposed to do? Think, Sora. Think just one more time. About who's most special to you. Call out to that piece of memory that glimmers faintly deep inside your heart. No matter how far away the light gets, your heart's voice will always reach it. Who's most special to me? <laughs> That's an easy one. It's you, Namit.
This is... that night! All of the islands you grew up on were sundered, scattered. Many hearts were forever lost to the darkness. Because of what you did! <clears throat> you hated being an islander, so you opened the door to darkness and destroyed the islands. It was you! You were pulled into the darkness then, and now you belong to the darkness. You should look. Look at what you truly are! Sora, it's me. Oh, what? Stop it, Sora. Don't you recognize me? Yeah, I recognize you. I can see exactly what you've become. How can the light hurt you? Riku, have you really become a creature of the dark? You're not Riku anymore. You're just a pawn of the darkness. So be it. It's time for you to face the light! I'm fading, fading away into the light. You won't fade. You can't fade. There's no power that can defeat you. Not the light, not the dark. So don't run from the light, and don't fear the darkness. Because both will make you stronger. Make me stronger? Darkness too? Yeah. Strength that's yours. The darkness inside your heart, it's vast and it's deep. But if you can, truly stare into it and never try to look away. You won't be afraid of anything again. All this time I've tried to push the darkness away. You've got to just remember to be brave. Know that the darkness is there and don't give in. If you do that, you will gain strength. The kind that's unlike any other. You'll be able to escape the deepest darkness. And I'll be able to see through the brightest light. Follow the darkness. It'll show you the way to your friends. Can I face them? You don't want to? You know I do. Of course. And I will. With my strength. My dark strength. Darkness! <laughs> Impossible! How is it that you found me, when you were there in the light? You reek of darkness. Even the light can't block the smell. <gasps> I guess I followed the darkness right to you. This is absurd. Then I shall make you see that your hopes are nothing, nothing but a mere illusion! Ah. <sighs> 
After all your protests, you're still like us on the side of darkness. I know who I am. When did that happen? You were always terrified of the dark before. Not anymore! <gasps> Shion! Surely, you must have known that this was going to happen. Why would I know? Because in your memory, You've been to a number of worlds before you came to this one. And, and of, course, of course, in those worlds, the only thing you need is you met with the dark heart. That's, that's all that's left, left in your heart. The dark uh, darkest uh, memories. Your uh, memories uh, of long ago. Uh, every uh, one. That's, that's a lie. lie. I remember I everyone from the islands. The islands. They're, They're my... 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 my. My closest friends. friends. And who uh, threw uh, away uh, those uh, friends? Uh, Maybe it's your it's own actions you've forgotten. It was you who destroyed your home. Who am I? What am I here for? Is it that I'm not supposed to exist? Well, what do you want to do, Xion? I want... I want to be... with you two. Then come back with us. I can't. Not the way I am now. But... What would it take for me to be like you? <gasps> Are you? Riku. Sora's friend. Sora? You know Sora? Yeah. Thank you. You saved me, but I don't know why... you did. I guess... I just felt like it. Riku, please. Tell me more. About Sora and that girl he's always with. You mean Kairi. Kairi. That's right. She's the one who looks so much like me. To Sora, she's someone very special. It's just... 
I remember things about the two of them. But I'm nothing more than a puppet. Something that somebody created. So why would I have... their memories? Do you know where Sora is now? That secret stays with me. Why's that? Shion. Your memories. They really belong to Sora. So you mean... I'm like... a part of him? When his memories were scattered, some of them... found their way inside you. Now. Sora has been put to sleep so that we can piece together his memory. Except... You can't because part of it is inside of me. That means... He can't wake up. Yeah. You got it. But... If you go with me to Sora right now, we could give the memories inside you back to him. So, do you hate me for taking your friend away from you? Nah. I guess... I'm just sad. Huh. I'm sorry. But... I can't go with you. It's my friends. They need me. And I need them, too. Maybe... You should take some time and think about it. Figure out who really needs you more. And where you belong. How will I know... where I belong? Truly. I'm not sure... I can promise you I'll come up with the right answer. Well, the answer you come up with... can't just be right for you. It has to be one... that works best for everybody. You and your friends, and everyone else. Thank you, Riku. Kairi, wait up! Hey! Do you feel like going out to the island? Tadis and Waka are all wrapped up in their ball game, and they won't go with me. Not today. Sorry. Why not? Do you remember those boys who used to hang out with us? Riku? Yeah. I wonder whatever happened to him. I sure miss him. He's far away. But I know we'll see him again. Sure. Of course we will. And the other boy? What other boy? The one who was with Riku and me all the time. We played together on that island. His voice always used to be there. And now it's gone. I can't think of his face or his name. I feel awful about it. So I told myself. I'm not going to the island until I remember everything about him. Are you sure you didn't make him up? Nominate? Namine, what's happening to me? Who are you? And that's not my name. I'm Kairi. Kairi, I know you. You're that girl he likes. Who? Please, a name. I'm Roxas. Okay, Roxas. But can you tell me his name? You don't remember my name? Thanks a lot, Kairi. Okay, I guess I can give you a hint. Starts with an S. Are you okay?
letter. I wrote it yesterday to the boy I can't remember. I said that no matter where he is, I'll find him one day. And when I stopped writing, I remembered we made a promise, something important. This letter is where it starts, I know it. Wow. I hope he gets it. He will. Starts with an S. Right? Sora? Restoration at 79%. Maybe waiting isn't good enough. My thoughts exactly. If you have a dream, don't wait. Act. One of life's little rules. You've got it memorized. Who are you? Axel. I happen to be an acquaintance of Sora's. Why don't we go see him? Sora? We've got something in common, Kyrie. You and I both miss someone we care about. Hey, I feel like we're friends already. You're not acting very friendly. I get back here. Aura! That voice again. Who are you? 
Hurt, are you okay, Flora? You even know my name. Have we met somewhere before? Well, sort of. I'm Mickey Mouse. I've never met you in this world, but I do know you, Sora. And Sora knows me. You can say we're really good friends. And so, we've never met before, but you seem to know who I am, and we're friends. Is that it? I don't understand. You see, I'm from another world, and gosh, it's kind of a long story. Anyway, there's this mystery me and my friends are trying to solve, but we can't get to your world, so we were hoping that maybe you could help us out. What do I have to do? Well, we're searching for an answer somewhere in that world you're in, and you're the only one who can find it. Why is that? Hmm, I don't know what's going on, but are you saying you want me to explore the island? Yeah, and that's it exactly. And if there's anything you need, I'll be right here. I got it. First, look for anything odd. I found that already. These blocks. What are they doing here on the island? Hmm. Well, and that's part of our mystery. All right. I'll ask around. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, and remember, Sora, we might be worlds apart, but you just say the word, and I'll do everything I can to guide you. No matter what happens, I'm always with you in spirit. After talking to your friends on the beach, you figured out that more mysterious blocks were popping up all over the island. They also told you that the suspicious person in the black hood was last seen heading to some place called the Secret Place. I heard he came this way. Am I too late? Maybe he went through this door. Whoa! What now? That voice! Who's there? Mickey? Ooh. Guess I'm okay, but what was that? This world has been connected. Oh, it's you! Now stand tied. Huh? There's a road for the taking. If you end, our world's aching. I don't understand that. Is it a riddle? So what am I supposed to do with that? To make this place whole. The keyhole's the place. The keyhole's the place? Uh, hey! Wait! Uh, hmm? Huh? What's that? Tora, what do you see? There's something weird here, Mickey. The guy in black left behind this... Uh... Well, it looks like a keyhole. Did he say anything to you? Hmm... He said, to make this place whole, the keyhole's the place. He must have meant this. A keyhole's the place. I know. Sora, try using the keyblade. You might be able to trigger something with it. Roger that. I'll try it. Tora, are you okay? Yeah, I think so. But what's happened to our island? I'm not sure. But whatever it is that's causing the glitches must be there. If I get rid of it, will the island be restored? I hope so. But be careful. Whatever's in there is powerful. 
Mm -hmm. I got it. Whoa! Thanks to you, I can access this world, now that you've weakened the bugs here. It's been a while. It has. Hey, do you remember when you left me that keyhole here before? Yeah. You needed a chance to prove yourself with the keyblade. You also needed to learn how everything works in the Datascape. I didn't know I'd have to face such a big monster. Did you know what was inside? Sorry about that. I didn't have time to show you the ropes. Inside the journal, the Heartless had already shattered the walls between worlds. And soon, more and more things were breaking down. The bugs were attacking the wall between the Datascape and the real world. I had to weigh all the options. I decided to use the damage to my advantage, and call Mickey and the others here to help. I know I put everyone in danger, but I had no choice. Mickey said there was a mysterious message added to the journal, right? After all this, we haven't figured it out. I think dragging everybody into this was wrong. As long as our friends get back safely, it'll be fine. We should go. Nothing's changed, huh? Nope. Nothing will. What a small world. But... part of one that's much bigger. Yeah. Hey, Riku. What do you think it was? The door to the light. <laughs> This. This? 
Yeah. It's always closer than you think. Sora! Riku! Hey, what's up? Look. From the king? I wanted to tell you right away about memories from the past that sleep within you and about the pieces that will tie you to your future. Sora, Riku, Kairi, the truth behind the Keyblade has found its way through so many people and now I know that it rests in your hearts. Sora, you are who you are because of those people, but they're hurting, and you're the only one who can end their sadness. They need you. It's possible that all your journeys so far have been preparing you for this great new task that's waiting for you. I should have known there were no coincidences, only links in a much larger chain of events. And now the door to your next journey is ready to be opened. Sora. Riku. Your mind's made up? Yeah. Sora. It's just, they really need me. I have to go. I am who I am. Because of them. <laughs> See you soon. But how far could a raft take us? Who knows? If we have to, we'll think of something else. Riku, a storm's coming. I know. The waves are getting steep. Furl the sail. Right. Riku! I'm fine. What's that? <laughs> oh, he was right. Those wretched guppies are here. Well, it's about time. We settled the score! Ursula? But how... Is this the test? Come on. Uh -huh. You can work it out later. All right. Sorry, dearies, but I won't fall for that trick.
Yes, this was where it started. At this point, I still had no idea that I was talking to myself. He cast away his bodily form just to set me on the appointed path. What do you mean? That is Xehanort, reduced to just a heart. The being you and your friends called Ansem. Whoa! Is that? Yes. The point in time that Zigbar mentioned. Me? Right before my world was swallowed by the darkness? To move through time, you must leave your body behind. Ansem first sent me on my way, and then placed himself here when the time was right. That is what set all these events in motion. What are you saying? That he knew everything that would happen? No, not everything. But remember, Ansem possessed Riku and saw his experiences in real time. So? That could only tell him so much. How did he know I would be here today? Simple. <sighs> Kyrie! Roxas? What is it that you're so afraid of? Huh? Hmm. Losing something that's important. Roxas? No. Wait. What is the one thing you care about more than anything else? Huh? Hmm. My close friends. What is going on? Huh? Sora! Who are you? Riku, what do you wish? More questions. All right. I wish... to recover something important that I lost. What's this? 
You were not the visitor I expected. Oh, Diz! I mean, Ansem the Wise. What are you doing here? Perhaps I wanted to atone for events of the past, even if no apology can undo the harm I have wrought. I felt that I ought to leave at least something behind. So I digitized myself and my research, and hid them within Sora. So this is... data? Yes. A clue, I hope, to finding yourselves or your lost friends in your hour of need. The heart has always been quick to grow. Each exposure to light, to the natural world, to other people, shapes this most malleable part inside of us. Nobodies are not different from us in that manner. Sora was the only one able to return to his human form without destroying his nobody. That is a statement to the love in his heart for other people and the bonds that tie them together. Perhaps he has the power to bring back the hearts and existences of those connected to him, to recreate people we thought were lost to us forever. Our most precious treasures, even an empty puppet, the trees of the forest, and the petals on the wind. There are hearts around us everywhere we look. And it does not take superhuman powers to see them. Surely we remember as children the way our hearts made everything seem so shiny and perfect. Sora has a heart like that, uncorrupted, willing to see the good before the bad. When he sees the heart in something, it then becomes real. When a connection seems broken, he may have the power to mend it. He has touched countless hearts. He has accepted them. And he has saved them. And some of those hearts have never left him. Whether they fell into darkness or were trapped there, whether they sleep in the darkness of Sora's heart, or were welcomed into its warmth. They can be saved. All Sora needs to do is be himself and follow wherever it is that his heart takes him. It is the best and the only way. The rest is in there. All right. Thanks. Thank you. Of course. Now, why is it that you are here? Uh... Uh... I kind of need to wake Sora up. Don't tell me he's gone to sleep again. Yeah. What'll I do with him? What, indeed? <laughs> <laughs> Never fear, Sora is safe. Huh? He's not here. You see, by defeating the nightmare imprisoning Sora, you freed him. Uh, you mean, the Sora wrapped in that black phantom? Then, you came here, and you were questioned by three young people. That was the final key to awaken him. Sora is awake. You can go home now. Really? Thank you. Young 
man. I do not believe you ever told me your name. Huh. It's Riku. Why do you think that gate took us here? Huh? A keyblade? How did it end up here? Hmm, maybe it's another guiding key. Sure, but to guide us where? Not you guys. Uh -huh. The realm of darkness. It isn't safe for you. Forget it. I'm going. Yeah. You can't make a whole pint without us. Come on, guys. Think about it. Even the king and Riku struggled in the realm of darkness. Someone needs to stay out here just in case. If something happens to the rest of us, you two need to carry on. Stop it! We understand, but we don't want you going someplace dangerous on your own. Thanks, guys, but I'll be fine. I'll make sure Riku and the King are safe. Trust me. Oh. Oh. You promised to be good. And come home nice and safe? Right. Aqua. Uh, Van. Terra. Aqua. Aqua. It's you. Thank goodness. You're awake. Mickey. Uh. Are these... The Destiny Islands? That's right. When did they fall to darkness? <sighs> You're in the realm of light. You're home. <laughs> You're <Yeah>. home. <laughs> Welcome home. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you known that I was with you? You did save me. <laughs> I think you came along for a reason. 
I didn't make much of myself as a replica. I was a failure, and after you and Sora moved on, my body fell to ruin and the darkness took my broken mind. I was all ready to give up and let it happen. And then you showed up. <laughs> you took that as a sign? <laughs> Maybe. I'd rather face my end with you than in darkness. That's what you want? Yeah. <sighs> but I'm not done yet. Got one last thing to see through. <laughs> Take the time you need. Hmm. Hey, why is Riku all alone? He said he needed time to himself. Let's let him be. Hmm. Here. What? Well, huh? <laughs> oh. Tomorrow's fight will be our toughest yet. I want to be a part of your life no matter what. That's all. Kairi, I'll keep you safe. Mm -mm. Let me keep you safe. 